Jagger in it, it's obvious. It's pretty obvious because I'm so good. Didn't even have to sing. <laughs> come on, let's see yours. I can only do one. One's enough, come on. Jesus Christ Almighty, what is that? It's Mo Tucker from Velvet Underground, isn't it? Mo Tucker from Velvet Underground? Yeah. It's more like Mo from EastEnders. Mo Tucker had a very distinctive style, right? She was upright, okay? Arms are 10 to 10, like that, right? And then she was on the drums, ready? Waiting for my man. What are you doing? Oh, all right, boss. Um, it's just um, teaching Penny how to do a more believable Mo Tucker. What, right, what is that? Oh, because hers are pretty substandard, if I'm honest. Hey, never mind about that. You've got customers. Can you serve them, please? Yeah, yeah. Hey, boss, I bet your favourite drummer is uh, Keith Moon from The Who. Nah, it's Kenny Jones. And the faces? Small faces. Hey, talk about the faces. Look at this. I had a flyer. Picked it up. It's the faces. Oh, yeah, I see. Yeah. And they've got uh, the yeah, fellow yeah, out yeah, of yeah. Uh, Simply Minds to, uh, to be the singer. He's playing Rod. Yeah, I know. Travis thing. And they put Charlie Drake instead of Mick Hutton. Oh, yeah. yeah. I never noticed that before. Look at that pen. Who oh, is it? Well, that there, they put Charlie Drake's big head over that ginger fella from Simply Red. He was in the. Listen, uh, uh, never mind about that. You've got a customer there. Can you serve him, please? Thank you. I think that's Paolo Hewitt. Yeah, I know he is. Do you know him? No, I don't. But he's a mod, like us. Penny. Penny. Come here. Let me take all that. Why is he calling you Penny anyway? It's not your name. Oh, it's because back in the van he said, well, this really bad case of VD and I was on pen and right. okay. for ages and the name's stuck. Mm. It's a terrible thing, that vaginal disease. Okay. I'm glad I haven't got one. The V isn't for vagina, it's for venereal right. Dixie. Well, venereal is Latin for fanny. Everybody knows that. Right. Right. Shut up. Right? Shut up. And you? Shut up. Can't talk about fucking VD behind the counter, all right? Get on with your work. It's like Pete Meaden said, boss, isn't it? What's that? Well, you know, you've got to make sure you're washed, and when times are tough, you know, it's like all about... Clean living under difficult circumstances. What about it? Who is Pete Newton? Who's Pete Newton? You wouldn't know him. He's an original modernist, darling. He's the guy that Pete Townsend will tell me about in Quadrophenia. Do you mean Irish Jack? No, no, it's, it's Happy Jack, and he wasn't Irish. He's from the Isle of Man. I love Quadrophenia. My dad's got it on video. It's an epic film. It's a shit film. The only mod film is Bronco Bullfrog. Bronco's bron Bronco Bullfrog. Sounds mental. I'll have to get it. Okay. Fuck me, that's Boy George. All right, all right, keep it down. Like, he's a customer, so what? Do you know him, boss? Yeah, I do know him. What's he like? He's all right, if you like that sort of thing. Can you introduce me to him? Introduce you? Why would I do that? Well, because I'm in the same industry as him. What industry is that? The music industry. The music industry. You're in the selling DVDs industry, mate. I've told you I've got a band, and I, I you yes, know. you have told me you've got a band. I don't care about your band, boy. George, I'm going to care about your band. Leave everything alone. Just do your job. Hello, Fox Common Garden. A box set of the Kaiser Chiefs. Now, where do I start with this, George? Brilliant to meet you. <laughs> My name is Dixie. How are you doing, Trace? All right. Good. Hey, listen, I work in the industry like you. I'm manager of a band. Tracy knows about them. Um, it sounds a bit cheeky, but can I have your number? Okay. <laughs> is that okay? Fantastic. Thank you very much. I'll give you a call. I manage a band, you see, called the uh, the Premature Congratulations. Okay. They're going to be the next big thing. Hey, listen, I've got a tape here as well. Chris, sorry. I know, yeah, with those MP3s, you can't touch them, can you? You know, they're not the real sorry, thing. George, like, uh, is he bothering you? No, no, it's fine. George, you know that song you did, uh, Teenage Fan Club by The Sweet yeah, on YouTube? Teenage, Teenage Rampage. Rampage. It's yeah. brilliant. You should release that as a single. Okay. okay. That is fantastic. That's brilliant. <laughs> that should be your next thing. Sure you will. Sorry about this, George. Oh, thank you very much. Sorry, Cheers, George. All right. Did you see that? Yeah, I did. Did you give me his number? Yeah, I did. Listen, Dix, um... Uh, I don't mean this is working out for me, all right? Are you leaving, boss? No, I'm not, I'm not leaving. I'm sacking you, all right? I'm sacking you, mate. That's the last straw. I told you not to go over to him. And you did it. You blew it, mate. Sorry. you got to go. Is it because I'm Welsh? Oh, fuck. What? I can do accents. Oh, fuck. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the store. Upstairs you've got DVDs. Downstairs you've got your books. Why are you doing that? Because I can do... A don't do it again. Okay, all right? It's, this is what I'm talking about, Dix, you know what I mean? You're not very good at your job. 
you go on all the time about you're in the industry and you know this and that about music, you don't know fuck all about being in a shop, mate. And that's your job. That is your industry. You're a shop boy. You know what I mean? Come on, man. We're both mods. We're no, we're not fucking. Don't say that. That's the main fucking thing that pisses me off about you. You think you're a fucking mod? You're I a fucking a mod. ticket at best. At fucking best, you're a ticket. You're nothing, mate. You're in a fucking Merc t shirt and a £2.50 Parker. Don't make you a mod, mate. Sorry, you gotta go. Pete, listen to me. Yeah. I can't lose this job, mate. Well, you can, but. No, I can't, mate. <laughs> I'm serious. I'm behind in my rent. I'll be out in the street, mate. And there's nothing out there. It's cold up there tomorrow, mate. There's no work. Can I, any, you know, can you just give me one more chance? Uh, no. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. It's company property. In the paper. Oh, that's... It's fuck. Thanks. Oh, it's that 207. My mate's got a shop, he might give you a job if you give him a ring. Oh, thanks, George. You're welcome. It's brilliant. <laughs> Thank you very much indeed. <laughs> you get them, Oh, Pete!